So now start with the submissions from the double underhook position, which is the strongest control. And I will show you my go-to move, my favorite submission from there, which is the forced, if you want so, forced triangle. And you will see you force really the triangle. You make the triangle happen because you are working on posture of your opponent. So we are here, close guard, same entry. We start from, we start from the 100% control, like always. Here, I control my leg. You see, this arm is free, because I grab with my right arm, my left foot. This arm is free. I go for double underhooks. From here, what I do is, I move my leg out and I pinch a little bit inside. You see, from here, I come over. You know, now, I remove my arm. Still, there is a neck crank. Still, there is my control, you see. And now, from here, you know, I can move a little bit backward and get him right into a broken down position. I can go for the triangle, for the armbar. His present posture is completely broken. I will show you that later from the other side, you will see. So here, underhook control. This arm goes for double underhook control. This is you can hold here for life. Now you push with your left arm a little bit to the inside, come up and come over the elbow. That's all you need, over the elbow. You grab your leg with your left, with your right arm, and you get out the other one. Still you have a neck crank. Now, you just push a little bit away, grab the arm, and you can go for a triangle, you can turn him, you see he's completely broken. Let's go to the other side. This is pretty strong. There's, there's not much of a gap. You see here, here, wow. Grab. I go inside, here, grab. Push. This way, come over, pull out, grab. Still I have his neck. This is not a triangle without head control. This is perfect head control. From here, I go for this one, I grab, come up, and I'm right here. I can go for some kaku, I can go for amba, I can just come back. You see, everything is pinched. His whole posture is broken. So, everything you do from there, it's so much more effective because you've broken his posture. Here, 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 grab, you control. Still, you, you wiggle out and still, you see, even when you make distance, you still have the neck. And then from the neck, you go to the elbow, which is still turn, creating torque and breaking down his posture. You go back, you see, and his whole Posture is broken, you can try an armbar, whatever. It doesn't, it doesn't matter much because the posture is broken. That is my go to move the triangle, armbar, whatever transition. You can see you break him completely down, you get the, the, the legs around his neck, he's flat on the ground nearly or at least parallel to the ground, his posture is broken, and you can go for armbars, for, for kimuras, for mablatas, for, for whatever comes from this position because he's completely shut down and you can't do, he can't do much.